Hey guys, in today's video I will show you what is in my work bag. I have seen some of these videos on YouTube and I thought it's kind of a fun spin on what's in my bag because, because it's always fun, at least for me, to know what other people have in their purses and especially if you're going to work and you know that's a place where you stay for 8-9 hours you usually carry a lot of your necessities and so I thought it's like a fun version of what's in my bag and I decided to do one myself. So the purse that I've been carrying and I've been carrying three different bags but the one I've carried the most is this one. This is the Henry Bendel Carolisle satchel I think and or Carolisle tote and I got this um, probably like five or six years ago and I love it I think it's a great bag but I do switch it up for the Neverfall that I have the Louis Vuitton Neverfall and I love the Neverfall because I feel like it just goes with everything Louis Vuitton is such a universal print you can wear it with whatever it always looks good and I like that it hangs on your shoulder and it's like a big open bag you can throw anything in but that bag does seem sometimes to be like a black hole once you put something in you just never take it out and so I decided to switch back into this one it, it's got more compartments it's just a little bit more convenient for work um, I really do love structure bags if you work in an office setting where you have to bring documents with you files and folders and it's just more convenient to me and I did not go through it and stage this video. I feel like sometimes when you watch these videos, it's like the bag is just so clean and neat and organized that there's just like no way that someone just took the bag and decided to film. They probably went through it and cleaned it out. So I did not do that. The only thing I did though was I had some loose tampons floating around. So I put them all in one um one thing um but that's all that i did there's probably a lot of garbage in here so yeah this is going to be messy but i have some things in here that i think for work for me are necessary to have they just make my life easier and make me more comfortable and so let's get through it so first i should probably show you the bag a little bit better so it says henry bandon here um this i like to keep open actually it gives it a little bit more of an easygoing look i think and it's got the tag that says Henry Bendel. This is a caviar leather. And when I first got this, I didn't realize that it's going to be caviar. So I was like, oh my God, that's so stiff. But it actually works better because it is, it stands up. It doesn't just slouch down when you put it down. The handles fit your shoulders really well. And um, the bag just looks like this. I really do like it a lot. Um, I don't know if they still have it. If they do, I'll link it. I know they have different versions of this bag. Um, I don't know if they have this exact one though. So let me just, this is what it looks like. So let me go through everything. This is my Louis Vuitton pouch that came with the Neverfall GM. I love it. I keep tampons in here. And the reason I keep tampons in here is because I have to go down a long hallway to get to the bathroom and I don't want to be walking around with tampons in my hands and I usually don't have pockets. So I keep them all in here, take this whole thing with me and that way no one knows that I have tampons on me, 50 of them. Um, so yeah, I think that that's a pretty convenient thing to do and usually even if you bring like a little makeup pouch. I don't know, I just, I like this better. You can just hang it on the door. And um, sometimes if I go out to lunch, I'll put my, I'll take out some tampons and I'll put like my credit card in here and my phone and my keys or whatever. So I don't have to take this entire bag with me. My hair is really bad today, just ignore it. Then I have a lint roller and I bring it home. I used to just leave it on my desk, but I bring it home because I don't have one at home. I have just the, the heads the changeable heads but I don't have this actual part so I have to bring it home if I ever need to use it I have to pick up another one when I go shopping and I have to have this with me all the time because I wear a lot of black and dark colors and I have this one scarf that I got at um, H&M that I'll probably show my favorites because I love it but it sheds like crazy you definitely need a lint roller so whenever it's cold I wear that scarf and then I just go into the office and have to roll my entire outfit then I have this pure grace body spray I use perfume every morning before I leave but I like to freshen up during the day and this is really really nice I love this smell the only thing is this perfume or body spray whatever you have in that line the scent doesn't really last a lot so you have to spray it constantly which is why I'm almost halfway down with this 
but it's light and it doesn't give people a headache if someone were to walk into your office they're not gonna be like whoa what's this you know sometimes perfumes are very very strong and this is really soft and I feel like everyone likes it then I have a the other end this is the secret invisible clean lavender scent I usually have problems in finding good deodorants I sweat a lot and it's hard for me to find something that really works but I find that this is really really good so I keep one because even though I use one in the morning but when I actually moved when I actually switched jobs in July um, it was when our offices were moving and we had to pack up and, and walk around and walk into the next building and move stuff around and I was sweating like a pig and so I had to have a deodorant with me I realized then that the morning deodorant does not cut it for me so I need to have something with me as well then I have a fork um, I just steal these from the cafeteria I usually bring a fork from home and I bring lunch but sometimes I forget and so I usually always have a fork in my purse sometimes a spoon and a knife too <laughs> um, then I have just my work ID I need this to even get in the door I have a Tom Ford lipstick in the color Pussycat it's one of these lipsticks that you can just wear with anything it's really nice for fall it's comfortable lasts long I love the color I have my car keys with the case um, this is just where I keep my license and my credit cards so that I don't need to carry a separate wallet. Since I got this like two birthdays ago from Peter, I haven't never carried a wallet with me. That was the fork. Then I have my house keys. I have a little Sephora mirror that I got with a gift card one time, which is really handy. I have a toothpaste and a toothbrush. This is from one of the hotels in... I don't remember which hotel, but it was from Spain. And they gave us these little things. And I keep it because in case I have like onions for lunch or something. If I ever need to brush my teeth, I can just use this. I have a lot of lip products, guys. Like, a lot. Um, I have Gerard Cosmetics Berry Smoothie, which I stole from my sister. Like a long time ago, I don't think she even knows. Then I have Sugar Tulip. I have Marc Jacobs Allow Me. I have just a regular chapstick, Nivea Mint Minerals. It's really, really nice, it's very minty. Then I have this little notepad because sometimes we have meetings that I have to go to right in the morning and I can just take it with me. I don't have to go into my office, into my desk first. This, I never go anywhere without this. I never leave my house without this. I never, like, I need this with me at all times. This is the daily agenda. I got this at Target. The brand is called um, Blue Sky. I love this. I put, like, all my bills that I have to pay in here. I put all my computer passwords that I might forget. I don't trust my phone because my phone got stolen last year and I had all my passwords on there and now I just write them down on paper because in case something happens I'll have it with me um I have a charger cable which I actually did not even realize I have I have some old like letters <laughs> I have a coupon to Dunkin Donuts it's a dollar off any Dunkin Donuts bakery set would they actually send me bags of these new coffees that they have they have what is it cinnamon coffee roll chocolate glazed donuts caramel coffee cake then they had like um what do they have coconut vanilla blueberry muffins they had a bunch of them and they're really really good so if you want to check it out give it a try then i have the lipstick queen lipstick in the color frog print I am almost done with this. This is literally all that I have left. It is the best. I love it so much. It's basically a lip stain and it's green, but when you apply it, it comes on pink, but it adjusts to your lip colors. So whatever, if you have darker lips, my lips are basically not existent <laughs> without a lipstick. They're very, very pale. This helps a lot and it doesn't wash off and it doesn't transfer. It's just a really, really good product. Then I have a bunch of pens. This one is from the Renaissance Hotel. I don't remember where it was, but I remember that I took a pen and I love this pen. Like, I never want to lose it. It writes so well. Then I have one of those thin Sharpies. 
They're my favorite. I love the thin Sharpies. And then I have the Paper Mate Ink Joy Pen. I bought a whole set of these at Michael's. They write really, really nicely. And that's all that I have. It's all I have in my bag. Um, so yeah, I have a lot of crap, but all of it I need, or at least I feel like I need. And then at my desk, I have like the hand lotion, the sanitizer. Um, I have a bunch of things at my desk, but this is just what I have in my purse at all times. So let me know what is in your work bag. And if you made a video, link it below so I can watch. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon. Bye.